Back in October of 2024, OpenAI introduced the Realtime API, which allowed developers to transform their text-based experiences and applications to speech-to-speech -speech applications. Today, we're updating this video that we produced for the beta because the OpenAI Realtime API is now generally available. Let's look at how to use OpenAI's Realtime API with Twilio. In this video, I'm going to start with the GitHub repo from the beta application and show you the changes that we made for the GA release. But by the time you're watching this, all of these changes I show will be incorporated into the GitHub repo. I'll start by cloning the repository. Then I'll use NPM to install the dependencies for the project. Then I'll open it up in an editor. The first thing you wanna make sure you do in here is make sure you have your OpenAI API key specified in the .env file. Now let's take a look at some of the changes that we can make for the GA release uh, that are different from the beta. The first is there are some new voices. There's a voice called Cedar, and here's what that sounds like. Hey there, it's very nice to meet you. Then there is a voice called Marin, and here's what Marin sounds like. Hey there, it's very nice to meet you. And then for comparison sakes, here is the alloy voice that we used in the beta application. Hey there, it's very nice to meet you. I'll use Cedar for the remainder of this video. The next change we're going to make has nothing to do with the OpenAI Realtime API. It has everything to do with the Twilio greeting that happens before the AI is connected. Here's what that sounded like. Please wait while we connect your call to the AI voice assistant powered by Twilio and the OpenAI Realtime API. For this application, we're going to use a much better sounding voice here. We're actually going to use one of our Google voices from Chirp and I'm going to add that to both of the say tags here in this twimmel. And then we're gonna change the verbiage in the twimmel so that it pronounces OpenAI Realtime API correctly with this Google voice. With these changes in place, here's what the greeting sounds like. Please wait while we connect your call to the AI voice assistant, powered by Twilio and the OpenAI Realtime API. Over in the Twilio docs at the link that's appearing on screen right now, there is this excellent UI where you can browse around, uh, filter out the language that you want, the type of voice. We've got some basic ones, some neural voices, some generative voices. You can pick a gender for the voice and you can pick a provider between uh, Amazon's Polly and Google Voices. And here you can filter down and then just grab the voice name over on the right to bring over into your application and put it in the voice equals parameter like I showed in the code. One last change here, it's the model name. No longer is it GPT-40 real-time preview 2024-1001. We're just simply going to change this to GPT-realtime. Also, this is no longer in beta, so we no longer need the open AI beta real time equals v1 as part of this tag. All right, let's test the application. I'll fire up node index.js and then I'll create an ngrok tunnel uh, on HTTP at port 5050, which will give me a URL that we can take over to the Twilio console for our phone number. And then over in voice configuration for my Twilio phone number, I'll just paste in that URL slash incoming dash call and save the number. And that'll set up that number to use this application. All right, I'm gonna use the Twilio dev phone to test this. You could just call it with your phone, but this makes it easier for me to demo. You can find out more about the Twilio dev phone from the link appearing on screen, but let's give this a call and see how it sounds. Please wait while we connect your call to the AI voice assistant powered by Twilio and the OpenAI Realtime API. Okay, you can start talking. Hi, how's it going? Hey there, I'm doing awesome. How about you? Feeling owl right today? Uh, <laughs> I get it. You're, you're doing the owl thing. Can you tell me a joke? Of course. Why don't owls ever go courting in the rain? Because it's too wet to woo. All right, that's that's pretty good. Uh, one last thing. Would you ever give me up? Never going to give you up. Never going to let you down. You know I've got your back always. All right, thank you so much. If you're interested in building this for yourself, head to the blog post at the link appearing on screen right now. And if you've enjoyed this video, like and subscribe and let us know in the comments what you'd like to see next.